Mr. Truck here. I am in Nashville, Tennessee at the NATDA convention. That's the North American Trader Deer Association. And I'm here with Andy Ackerman. He's the president and CEO and the founder and the big cheese and all that. Andy, how's it going? Uh, it's been going great. We're very excited about the 2015 show, Ken. This is number eight? Number eight. Mr. Truck here in Nashville, Tennessee. I'm at the NATDA convention looking for all the cool stuff, and I found one. It is hindsight cameras. It is remote cameras. It is wireless cameras, which we're always looking for. And I'm here with the inventor with these big cheese, Melissa Thompson. So tell me all about it. Yeah, sure. So it's a wire-free camera and monitor system that's really quite unique and different than anything else that's out there. So there are no wires required, so you can basically mount this anywhere you want. You can put it inside your trailer for monitoring your cargo or your animals or your horses. You can put it on the outside and use it as a backup system. And when you're done using it on your trailer, you can use it for hunting, for fishing, for watching your steaks on the grill while you're watching football. So I like that idea. I like the idea of putting it on the back of the truck so I can back up with it. Absolutely. And it's put it on the back like I pull doubles a lot of times. I can put it on the back trailer and see what's going on back there. Yep. Man, you can use cameras for about everything. I think they're great. And wireless is the big deal because nobody wants to twist all those little wires together in the winter when they're froze. I've done that before. Yep. But this is awesome. And, you, and it's basically weatherproof? It is. It's totally weatherproof. It's totally waterproof. You could actually submerge it in water if you needed to or wanted to. Okay. And it floats. Awesome. Now, has any horse bit it in two or... <laughs> What what, what horses did to this? Because you know horses they like to bite things. Yeah. No, no, no. We have no reports of horse damage yet. So, <laughs> but it does kind of look like a carrot. So. Oh yeah, it's the right color. I don't know if they're colorblind or not. But you know, I did water testing once on water evaluation on a, on a horse meter, and we had a horse that kept grabbing hay and putting it in front of the camera. So I guess that means they're shy or bashful or whatever. But they, they it's interesting stuff. But this is awesome. You got a lot of accessories, so you can put it anywhere, you can hang it anywhere, and you can go battery or hardwire. Yes, so it's got a lithium Palmer battery on it, so it'll hold the charge for five to eight hours. But if you're hauling for lo more than eight hours and you want to have power to it, you can plug it into a cigarette lighter, or we have a wiring harness that you can adapt to any, any trailer light or situation with a USB. That's awesome. What's, how long is the warranty? The warranty is a full year, so it's a full year replacement warranty. Anything goes wrong with it, we'll replace it in a year. And you put them together here, they're in, you got your own engineer, and, and so they're... Yeah, we've got a 7,000-square-foot uh, warehouse in Peterborough, New Hampshire, That's and uh, it is big. <laughs> it is big, and it's full of product, so we're ready to oh, sell wow. product. Well, that's great. Uh, that's, but, this, this is good. Yes, it is good. Yeah. yeah well, the horse industry, everybody, everybody wants a camera. I mean, they've gotten, they've gotten big. You know, we've got YouTubes all over the place. And everybody's filming everything we do. And yep. this way you can take pictures of your horses while he's doing funny things. And yeah. keep, see how healthy he is. See if he's tied up. See if he's slipped over in the trailer. All those safety issues, you kind of need to keep track of them because you know, they can get tangled in their halter. They can get tangled in the tie rope. They can get, you know, they can get in a lot of trouble. Yeah. Well, and it's not just for the horse industry. So, you know, there is new DOT regulation coming out that is effective as um, 2018, that if you're towing anything that's 10,000 pounds gross weight or less, you need a vi rear visibility system on it. So that's certainly an application for any kind of commercial hauling whatsoever. Um, and again, you know, it's been used for, we've got crop dusters that are using it. We've got farmers that are using it in the agriculture industry. Yeah. We've got them, they're on tractors, they're on combines. Um, so we've got people that are thinking of ways to use that we would never in a million years think of using it. Yeah, that's a big safety thing. I grew up on the farm, you know, I knew, I know several three-fingered friends. <laughs> and that, it's much better to send the camera in there than your hand in Absolutely. there. And I like that idea. And you're like, I'm a CDL, so I've got my big commercial license. So it's always important that I pull doubles a lot, two traders by my truck. And I like to have a camera on one watching the other when I can't see it with the mirrors. Right. And you know, mirrors... I mean, if you're eight feet wide, eight and a half feet wide, you can't see really around the side of the trailer. You got to do the whip thing to see it. Having a camera there is, is a much better idea. Yeah. Well, as soon as you hook anything up to your car, or your truck, you can't see behind you. So, yeah. you know, and and let's face it, you know, rear view cameras, backup cameras only work when you back up. 
Yeah. But this provides you with that visibility 100% of the time. And uh, I, I rented an RV about a month ago, and I put one of these on, and I could not have driven it without oh, sure. without it because there's nothing in that rearview mirror. Oh, yeah, they're, they're eight and a half feet wide, and oh. there's not much room there. I, <laughs> it, yeah, it's pretty crazy. And I've got grandkids, and so I always like to see what's going on behind me. I always stop and get out, and you know, it's it's important to know what's going on back there. Well, and when you when your grandkids are out swimming in the pool, you can use it for watching your grandkids swimming. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, I can't help them because I can't swim, but. There you go. If they cry out, I'll figure out something. Well, thanks, Melissa. This You're was welcome. great. Uh, really got a great product. Now, we're going to be testing it because we need to see how well it works. Yep. So we'll find out. So stay tuned. All right. Thank you. You bet.